What's good? It's Jagozi. It's Wednesday, April 11th, 2018. And we're just going to see more very well-rounded examples of how the Freemasons, the Jewish Zionists, and the Jesuit Order crafts propaganda on a daily basis, essentially controlling the world in this way. Because since everyone believes the propaganda, they can make whatever they want, say whatever they want, and then lead you down the path of agenda. Quickly want to point out, he's wearing blue and or, or he's wearing blue, he's wearing green and orange. How, I know some of you are laughing right now. Just look at this. Orange equals 33, green equals 137, the 33rd prime in Gematria. Two very new world order colors. And then on top of that, they're drinking Pepsi with the obvious Pillars of Freemasonry logo, all inside ISIS propaganda. So if you're new here and you're like, oh, is ISIS real? Is ISIS really the federal government? Yes, ISIS is the federal government. And this picture right here clearly shows more. Orange, 33. We're in green as well. Green in the Jewish cipher sums to 33. Or 137, the 33rd prime number. So green and orange. And then we, of course, have Pepsi. Pepsi 2529, like Trump, like Pi. ISIS 56, see? Perfect. Art inside the propaganda. We're going to go back to this. So anyone new here, anyone who's not new here, don't you see I always show this? Always decode the brand of beverage that the actors drink inside the propaganda. For example, Donald Trump's propaganda and the trials, they'll drink Deer Park water because Deer Park equals 48 and 138, like Donald Trump. Of course, you get the 78, 42, like Jesuit, because he's a Jesuit, is always Jesuit order propaganda, especially with Donald Trump. So now here we have, again, we have ISIS propaganda. ISIS equals 52 reverse in alphabetical order and 56 not reversing. And then see the art they do, they're going to reflect both of these. They're drinking Pepsi. So reversing, it's 25 now, just reducing, but still the reversing alphabetical order and now 65. See? So that, I mean, that's obviously, obviously beyond coincidence. Because it is a play, these are actors. I mean, I don't know why I say the same thing every video. These are plays, these are actors, and you're being deceived with Masonic propaganda. So, we're going to see what time this is updated at. But we can already do another analysis. See how this is updated at 141, for about 33, 141. And we're just talking about 33 in the colors he's wearing. But it's also 941 AM. And this goes to show, it's a perfect example when people question why I only pick up the minutes, you know, logically, the minutes are very important. That's what's constant. 941, the 13th prime number. USA equals 41. A lot of things 41, just but just understand it's the 13th prime. That's why they love that number. So, if you think that's it, look at this Syria propaganda. This will see this actor, Donald Trump, right here. You click on that, you get this piece of propaganda updated at 401. So, and we've seen this a lot. The same numbers on adjacent pieces of propaganda. So this was updated at 941, this ISIS piece. And then this Donald Trump piece updated at 401. See, 401, 941 is the same numbers inside the propaganda. It's exactly what I'm trying to show every single time. 340, the video, that's just 34, a number for murder. And if you're wondering why this is all coming out today, understand. Look at the date numerology all the time. Look, our favorite pattern, 4417 numerology, also did with 33 numerology. The 53rd day of the year, not, it's not the 53rd day of the year, excuse me, they were 53 numerology. So I want to point out, they do put this number around ISIS propaganda all the time. Like ISIS equals 52 and not 53, but still. Call it out again. So. Just, just slow down and understand what I'm trying to say. 
Poison Daughter of X Spy, Life is Now Totally Different. So that's going to have death, sacrifice numbers. Just because of the nature of the story. I haven't even read it yet. Okay. So New World Order 75. Key of David 75. Architect 87. Freemason 42 The Reflection. Very interesting. But then you just see more. I mean, look, I put it at 824. And the thing sums to 204. I mean, it's just even that. You don't have to understand. You can just see that they're putting the same number. Look, this is a Russian name, Russia 24. I mean, she, she might not be Russian. She could be something else. But, you know, based on oh, Russian, you know, of course. And how to see if this was real news, she could be from any part of that of the world like that. Any of the... Nations surrounding Russia, any of the former USSR places, but how we can easily understand it's Russia is because we see 24 inside here. See 24, 24 in the minutes, and then Russia equals 24. See? And 87, just like, so that's why they called 87, 24, 75. That is why, see? If you don't fully get what you decode, you further decode the propaganda, and then you easily see what they're trying to tell you. Totally different in Russia over like Gematria. See, 87, 24, 75. Totally different. 84, or 24, 87, 75. See? Very easy to see this propaganda. Sacrifice numbers are in her name then. So remember when I first saw this, that we're going to sacrifice numbers here? No. Sacrifice numbers are in her name. And then the numbers for Russia are in the little quotes here. So it's a Russian sacrifice. This is Russian propaganda. This See Donald Trump right here? That's also Russian propaganda. Everything on here is Russian propaganda because who is Russia? The blue and red pills of Freemasonry. It's no coincidence. Their flag is like that. It's the same exact gang of Zionist Jews and Freemasons running it all. Facebook is a Russian software propaganda application. It's all American too. It's the same exact thing. You can use them interchangeably. That's what I'm trying to get at. So her name has 55170, tragedy 80, but 55170, numbers for sacrifice, bam, bam, right here. So, of course, today is 411. Assassin equals 411. World War 114. Oh my goodness, it's so obvious. I wish I opened up with this. World War 114, 42. Look at this World War propaganda we get. Russia, you know, Russia spies. ISIS. Syria strikes. It's perfect. All we need is North Korea, and we're set. That's literally all they're missing. It's absolutely, maybe they just couldn't fit it. I mean, they needed. More Russia propaganda instead. But Russia propaganda links to North Korea propaganda anyway. Yes, this is all North Korean propaganda. It is all German propaganda. So I have this up because I know some people are asking me to show more about how this propaganda affects the stock market. Very, very well understand. The propaganda fully affects a lot of the stock market. Based on what Trump's doing, saying, based on what narrative's coming out, based on this, like oil's up now because of this whole Syria thing. You see how it's working? So since oil goes up, then the stocks that relate to that go up or down. See, it's crude oil has just been climbing since its propaganda's come out. And then you go to stocks that relate to that. They hit, they start breaking out of the normal patterns. So if you understand this, you just put your money where the propaganda is going and you start making money. See, it was this high back in January, but now it's been uptrending. And then now it's starting to break out of these normal highs it was. Likewise, this, this is the SP500 ETF spider. See how it's, it went down today. I want to show this because a lot of times, and this is a little trick, on Dayton's 4417 numerology, this type of stock will go down 
and stocks that benefit off the follow the market ETFs like TVIX will go up. Just a small percentage today, but it's still profit. And I understand. I I could have told you yesterday that this would have gone up today just because of this. I said normally TVIX goes up in this 44, 17 numerology because that's when the propaganda reports that the markets are bad or something like that. So that's what I'm trying to say. Like understanding that it gives you like don't just rely on gametria numerology to invest or anything. I mean you want to use other things too, but that really gives you a very well-rounded look into what type of propaganda is going to be out. I mean, if I always show you what type of propaganda is going to be out that day, then you bet that you can use that knowledge on so many levels. It's like predicting the future. I mean, it's pretty obvious how powerful this knowledge is. We'll be coming 65. If you some of the advisors are 48, you get one, two, four. Go Saturn 21. 401. Yeah, still the 401. Update time. You know, 657. Trump's tweeting this. See, Russia 75 updating at fix 657. President just tweeted something that is the most direct. Freemason 122. Circle 40, design is 40, 40 people. Man, look, let's look at this shit. That's what I'm saying. This is not an actor? If you're still, like, if you don't get the numbers, if you don't get anything I've been talking about for the past 11 minutes, then we'll start afresh. This this is the man responsible for tweeting these things and stocks going up and down all this crap. This actor. That's what I'm trying to drive home with the stage prop behind him. He is participating in predetermined, scripted propaganda and then joking about it, being a little ass while he's doing it. Obama did the same thing. Bush did the same thing. George Washington did the same thing. So I'm showing you how you can understand what they're doing. It's how it's by the numbers. You can look at the date numerology. I mean, you should always start with that. You should have seen the date numerology today, 4417, and probably not you know, bought shares of SPY, or, yeah. Because you would have known, like, I would never in my life buy a share of this on a date with 4417 numerology, because the market, you know, eight times out of ten goes down on dates with that numerology. But then knowing that, then you could have shorted it. You could have borrowed the shares at the beginning of the day from your broker, and at the end, Bought, bought them back. So you buy, you, you borrow from your broker, you sell them when they're high, and then it gets lower because you know it's going to go down because of the propaganda and other indicators. And then you just buy them back and sell them for cheaper. And, you know, I always explain that too in this channel. So many ways you can do this. And I'm not saying, oh, go now and just only, you know, only apply this and only just on a whim invest in these. No, like there's more to it. I'm just, you, again, showing you how you can supplement you're investing, you're trading with this knowledge. It's no different than betting on scripted sports. You understand how the sports are scripted, then you use that to your advantage and make money. I mean, it's literally the same thing, just with less ritual sacrifice and all other, and, you know, I would say this is even easier. Saying uh, Satan 64, a sperm whale that washed up on a beach in Spain at 64 pounds, Thelema 64, Israel 64, Zion 64, of this, a 248, hoax 48, with a 96 second video, Freemason 96. 60, 64 pounds. Oh, the, th the 33 foot long mammal. This one's what I'm talking about. A 33 foot long mammal is what they're talking about, the sperm whale. Masonry 33. There are 33 degrees of Scottish Rite Freemasonry. There are 33. Vertebrae. So many things. Spiritual ascension is when your Kundalini gets activated because the spiritual energy in the, in the spine rises to the top of the vertebrae, the top one. 11, the master number. I mean, that's what I'm just trying to say. Anyone new 
notice how I just scroll down the propaganda and you see, you first see how they've, that's what I'm saying, all you do is <laughs> control F, type in 64, three out of four, I mean, they put the number 64 so many times in this piece of propaganda. That's the first thing you can notice. Second thing is how these are numbers for Freemasonry, Freemason 48, Freemason 96. <laughs> so <laughs> again, pairing Gematria inside the times. They do this all the time. Freemason 48, 96. So updated at 248 with the 96 second video. So then you can then also see why is it a sperm whale? Sperm whale. Sperm 64, see? A 64 whale. So they give you what type of whale? One with a 64 gametria with the 64 pounds. Sperm whale 48, oh my goodness. And 150, there's a 150 in this piece of propaganda. Sperm whale 48, updating this piece of propaganda at 248. And of course, control F, 150, around 150 million tons of plastic already floating in our oceans. Illuminati 150, this is Illuminati propaganda. Illuminati 48, 150. You know, dancing with these numbers. 69, the reflection 96, 96 second video. Just unbelievable. Of course, on February 27th, 227, the 49th prime of Relation 49. 22 divided by 7 is 3.14. Going back to pi. Why on Cabo de Palos? You know, why on this beach? 93.39. Oh, my goodness. 93. Saturn, 93. Propaganda, 93. 39 to Reflection. Number of books in the Old Testament. Saturn. 42 to reflection of 24. This is another Saturnian ritual. On 227, Saturn the keeper of time on 227, pi time cycle circles, put in this night parent with his 93. 33 feet long again. 64 pounds. You know, Thelema, Israel, Zion. 64th, Lima honoring the number 93, Israel honoring the number 93, doing all but 9339. Of course, we're going to find one of those in, the, in this place. So let's see why they're using a whale in this. Whale 49. So whale equals 49. And what? This piece of propaganda, this picture, the mammal was found on 227, the 49th prime. You, again, you see how this works. I, I, I try not to go fast, and I try to repeat myself a lot. On February 27th, see how this looks like that date? It is the 49th prime, and then they're saying it is, they found a whale, 49. What kind of whale is it? A sperm whale? Sperm, 64. is 64 pounds, and you write it all out. Sperm whale. You get 48, updating the propaganda, 248, with 150 million tons of plastic. You understand how I can flow this so easily. It's not that I'm so good. It's not that I'm so smart. It's not that I'm so good at numbers. It is that the federal government plays around with these same little patterns and laces inside the propaganda. Go find a random article and do this. And you can't do this. You can't repeat this. You'll find little small little overlaps here and there, but nothing really makes sense. You know, and there's always more like. I see the gematria in this person's name. I know there's a 70 in the article, a 70 here, but there's more of that. Some of 48's divisors is one, two, four. You know, 48. So they relate, but you know, there's always more. And I don't like, again, if you're new, I don't like to, you know, this is 70, by the way, the name some 70. I don't like to try to make things if they're not obvious, or, you know, if I can't make full sense of them. I like to be as real as possible, like this. Donald Trump, the Saturnian actor, tweeting this at 9 a.m. 9. If you're on 9, you get 42, like Russia. 9, 42, 24, Russia. 24, with the S exception. S to 19th letter, 1 plus 9 is 10. So add them all, you get 42. Sun equals 9. Sun, the keeper of time. Saturn, the keeper of time. Judge of order, all reduces to 9. Their logo is the sun. 
Sun equals 54, 27, reflection 72. I mean, it's so obvious what's going on. So then, then who do we have? The Jesuits attorney and actor. <laughs> and this piece of propaganda up there at 9 a.m. Kind of mean more perfect. That's what I mean. Like, I'll explain it all day long. Or this. I mean, we can all understand this. The Saturnian actor in this tweet at 12.45 a.m. Just like you click on the Summer Saturn's Magic Square. You get nothing else than an array of Donald Trump propaganda. Look at this. Look at the mocking. The picture that we're also analyzing earlier, telling you how it's a piece of shit, mockery, joke, comedy sketch you live out. And that's the main picture on this piece of propaganda array. It's unbelievable. So here, I mean, I clicked on this thing to show you the house. See, it's Biden numbers tweets all the time. How many times does he tweet stuff at something 45? This is a bunch of crap propaganda. That's all it is. I got to end this video because I don't want to start making those 25, 30 minute videos again. I don't, not that I didn't like those, but I mean, I could just hit stop and then start again. So we'll talk about one more piece. Oh, breaking. Perfect. We're just going to see how many days from his birthday this came out and we'll see what, you know, I'm not going to spend much time on this. You know, updated at 61. So today's a 61 day. Some of the things I've been encoding, you know, the person, that person's name had the 14860 or 12461. Something else I decoded had a 12461. That's up to the 610. 61's the 18th prime. 61's the number they code in assassinations a lot too. You know, death kind of numbers. Killer, killer, 31, 127, the 31st prime. Again, it's always death killing numbers ritualistically on these events. I know he's not dying, but again, it's always symbolic. And of course, I just got done teaching you again. And when I say that, it's not to belittle anyone. I mean, it's literally that. I teach you this pattern all the time, not because I want to. It's because every single time on a date with 4417 numerology, we get this type of propaganda. You know, Mark Zuckerberg's on trial again today. Kevin Spacey now. And some debt. So we're going to get this type of pattern trope from his birthday. That's what I'm saying. That's to confirm. You use another form of analysis, which is my personal favorite, doing it from the birthday. So we'll figure out when this actor was born. Kevin Spacey, Obama, Donald Trump, they are exactly the same. They're all actors for the Freemasons. And again, before he turns, no, no, no. He was born in 59. He's 58 now. So, you know, he'll, he'll be in some more propaganda when he's 59, but especially now, again, 59, 58, Freemasonry, 59, 58, just like how NASA's in all this propaganda now, NASA founded in 58, they're 59 years old, Kevin Spacey, born in 59, he's 58 years old, and Masonic propaganda, so we'll see from his July 26th birthday, from this propaganda event to then, we'll see how long, and then once you see how long, it'll fit some death pattern. Could be numbers for Freemasonry too, but I think it's going to fit the whole death, sacrifice type of trope. Well, to get the what I was saying out the way, that's a span of 107 days. Kill <laughs> equals 17. The date was 17 numerology. See how I called this out before we did it? Don't be blown away. It is This is how the federal government operates. It is that simple. Of course it's going to be like this. That's what I'm trying to say. It should not be any surprise to any of you. If it still surprises you because you're not comfortable with your federal government, you're just not. I'm very comfortable with them because I know what to do. It doesn't mean I want them around. We need to get rid of them ASAP. But look at this. 107. That's also the 28th prime number. See? So this is one of their favorite kill numbers because it's a multiple patterned entity you it represents 17 kill 17 and it's the 28th prime number kill equals 28 17 see on date with 44 17 numerology remember we get the 64 ton well they're talking about this is possible part of that little game you guys are all about killing it's, it's the jesuit order i mean do i have to explain that it's the catholic church giving us propaganda it's the Zionist jews the freemasons this is just so easy to see. 
And I say all the time because I really don't know how it can be any easier. So 107, but without the end date, you know, I can't ignore that too. 106 days, prophecy 106, 15 weeks one day, 151, the 36 prime. But this 106 for prophecy, 107, 20th prime, I mean, kill numbers right there, as I said. Not because I'm a know it all. See, will be coming 124, 61, as I had Trump, Trump say. 61. The case involves events that reportedly took place in October 1992. I wish they gave us the uh, actual day. Ritual 45. The case was presented to the Los Angeles District Attorney's Entertainment Industry Sex Crimes Task Force on April 5th. So this is nothing else than a... The, so the Entertainment Industry Sex Crimes Task Force is nothing else than a theater troop from the Freemasons. Put it on rituals, ritual 45. Events 31, no killer. If I want to see Kevin Spacey, see why he's coming out today as well as his name. Spacey 33, and they were 33 numerology coming out. You can see that. And then the 4417 ritual. You know, Freemasonry 58, you, I just explained this. He's 58 years old, born in 59. His name sums to 58, 59, and he's in this piece of propaganda. So we're going to end it there. So, oh, so Yulia Skripal, the Russian actor that we've been talking about that was poisoned, but very well, she could have been ritualistically sacrificed by Vladimir Putin's employers or the same employers of Donald Trump and Obama. So she could have been ritually sacrificed by them at 33 years old. Who dies at 33? Jesus Christ. It's a sacrificial number. On date with 33 numerology, they're putting this out as well. See? And the whale, remember the whale was 33 foot long? That's what I'm saying. 33, we all know 33 is a number for Freemasonry. That is not a joke. It really is. You can ask any Freemason ever. So masonry equals 33. We're just going to end with this real quick. If anyone's confused, if anyone thinks I'm pulling shit out my ass, masonry equals 33. There's 33 pillars on the on your federal government's building, the Masonic Temple in Washington, D.C. That is the real federal government, not the theater troop next door. So they have 33 pillars. There's 33 degrees of Scottish Freemasonry. I explained the vertebrae. You know, who has that? People. People, 33. Society. You have the police ruling you over with their order by the numbers. Federal 33, federal law 42, like Freemason. But anyway, so 33. So then why are they saying, I guess it's not a coincidence that she's 33 years old. It's not a coincidence that this whale that we had earlier is 33 foot long. On day with 33 numerology, the game is all this World War flavored propaganda. Kevin Space, Spacey, 33, coming out on date with 13 numerology. 107 days from his birthday and date with 17 numerology. 107 to 28th prime, kill, 28, 44, 17. And I called that before I showed it, just to emphasize this is pattern. Trump, 38, reversing EP exception. So reversing that political order, EMP becomes the 22 and 11, you know, the master number rules without reducing and all that. Death Killing Murder 38, Saturn 21, Trump and Saturnian Propaganda 21, see? So, Paul Ryan's sudden exit. Again, I said... This is an assassination day. Kill numbers. Sudden exit. We're talking about exiting, killing, leaving. See? It's all symbolic. I want to be clear. I'm not done yet. I'm oh, yeah, yeah. He's not done. He's going to be, he's an actor. Why would he be done? As above, so below. 222. Order out of chaos. 222. Updating this at 222. I mean, just think about 222. Does that know what that means? It's the Freemasons obviously playing with numbers in that time. 47 second video, President 47, Trump 47, White House 47, Government 47. See? This is government propaganda. Government 47. From the White House 47. Who's, who's leading it? 
well, the Freemasons, but the actor in chief right now, Donald Trump, 47, you know, this attorney and buffoon fulfilling the role of Saturn, the keeper of time. Time 47. It's time for him to go, according to the propaganda. So he announced this today. We'll do this from his birthday. It's just perfect. All these, all this information, all these examples inside this piece. I love it so much. Because this is why people learn. This is how people learn. I'm pretty sure I got, you know, got some new subscribers over the time, and that's what I'm saying. Like I get someone new here, and then they watch this video and they see how I show you it was going to be kill numbers from Kevin Spacey's birthday before I did it. That like increases the validity of this work. I could care less if I, you know, because there's so many times I will say something I don't get it right. And not like, you know, not like it's like, oh, he's just guessing or, you know, wildly, but it's like, like the Russia thing. The headline didn't have the sacrifice numbers, but her name did, but that headline had the exact numbers for Russia. So, when, you know, when I figure it out, then it's just even more damning. So, this actor born on 129, you know, America 129 to today. I mean, this one's birthday. Look, sacrifice 73. Sacrifice 73, death 213. It's exactly 213 days. Oh my goodness. Sacrifice equals 73. See, kill sacrifice numbers. This is all we get on this type of day in these propaganda events. Sacrifice 73, 170, 107 days from Kevin Spacey's birthday. Sacrifice equals 46 as well. There's no 46 here, but let's see it somewhere. But anyway, death, 213, satanic. I mean, this is another 30 minute video that I love, though, because it's just nothing else than a bunch of examples of how this is coded propaganda every single day. Death, 213, sacrifice, 73, 73 days from his birthday. Or, six, or two months, 13 days exactly. He's announcing his resignation. It's also a sun ritual, so we get the 72 days, reflection 27. It's a span of 103 days, the 27th prime, United States of America, 102. Again, that's what they, guys, they like to overload these things. They like to, they like to make things work as much as possible. I mean, those who mistakenly think it's me making things work, trying to prove a point, I don't get it. Because there's the times I don't understand it, I let you know every single time I don't get it. And that is more. I don't front. Radical art near White House. Look, look, look what the White House is putting out some more entertainment. Burning Man is at the is at the White House. Oh, that's not, yeah, well, that's ritualistic as hell. Uh I don't want to read through this. I'm gonna make this video longer for no no reason. But we saw Paul Ryan is participating in coded propaganda. You know, four number for death foundation, the four points in here. So there you have it. Paul Ryan is an actor. He participates in fake news propaganda by these numbers all the time and never fails. Paul Ryan with the sun numbers, you know, sun 18, doing this 72 days from his birthday. You know, Freemasonry 58, Donald 50, 23, see Ryan, Donald. You reverse, you get Ryan for the last name, for the first name of the first, of the actor, Donald Trump, you get 50, 23, see? It's always art inside this propaganda. So, oh, so perfect. So glad I caught this. Look at this. $223 million Red Sox roster worth every penny. 223. That's the number for the Synagogue of Satan. Synagogue of Satan, 223. Masonic, 223. The Synagogue of Satan is Masonic. The Scottish Rite Freemasons are the Synagogue of Satan. The MLB is the Synagogue of Satan. The Synagogue of Satan is the false Jews, as spoken of in Revelation. You beware of the Synagogue of Satan. Those who say they are Jews, but they are not. 
We all know how the Jews run the entertainment industry and, you know, run. I do that because I'm saying it's not it's not as plain or plain as that. It's not just some Jewish people running MLB. It's a bunch of agenda based old world order, tyrannical Zionist Jews, Jesuits, Freemasons in high places running this all by this code. You know, they don't even <clears throat> the normal Jewish people you're thinking of, they don't even like them. And the real Jews, the black people, they obviously do not like them. You know, I'm trying to explain my best. I mean, who's beyond who's who's behind this? Who's behind this? It never ends. This is April 9th. I'm just trying to see when Wozniak said Billy, this. But I don't think I don't think we should. Time one forty four, see? Quitting. One forty four number connected to assassinations as well. For about forty four, you get hundred forty four, kill forty four. Disgusted. Like why is he saying that? Sun numbers, the key of David one three five. I mean, this is how I'm just showing how fast it is. And you see Steve Wozniak. If you can't even find out the exact day, you know that came out April 9th, Revelation 49. So you can just do August 11th, April 9th, and you'll see. You can do his last birthday. You can do his upcoming one. I'm not making this up. That is what I'm trying to say. I'm not making this up. So I'm doing it so quickly. 241, the 53rd prime. 343, you know, 777, Cuba Saturn. We're talking about Apple in this. You need to stick around. You do Apple's Gematria. And I'm probably confusing someone at this point, but it's all about digging around. You know, you notice his number, his name is 36 pattern, 151, the 36 prime. 36, 36, right here. Steve Wozniak, 53. I was looking for this 53. That's what I'm saying. I was looking for this 53. Wow, are you this is this, I, this is great. This is great. So do you see this? I, I see how quickly I got this up. We look at Steve Wozniak inside the propaganda. We see how he's doing something. We first couldn't find like them explicitly saying, okay, in this date, Steve Wozniak did this. But we see how the published time in the URL, April 9th, so very could be this day, they always release propaganda, publish it from the birthday. See? So, I just said, okay, go to him right away. See from August 11th to his to this day, we did that. 241 days exactly. See, 241. That is the 53rd prime number. The 53rd prime number, and you just look at you type his name, Steve Wozniak. That's who's the actor's propaganda. Steve Wozniak equals 53 in the full reduction. And then the Jewish cipher is sums to 241, the 53rd prime. Again, beyond coincidence, all the time. Now I kind of want to see what date numerology April 9th, 2018 had. Well, 99th day of the year. Wozniak equals 99. Wozniak, <laughs> Wozniak equals 99. On the 99th day of the year, participating in this piece of propaganda, 241 days from his birthday. See? The 53rd prime. So easy. Yes, the Zionist Jews who practice this form of Jewish mysticism tell him what to do. He is an actor. She is an actor. Why do you think I call all these people actors? Because they are all, always doing it this way, by this code, by these numbers. Mark Zuckerberg the same. And I've been calling out we haven't had Israel, the key of David, 63. We haven't had many Israel numbers with him on these days he's been out. But that's why, I think about it, the day with the very good Israel coding, Philemic coding, is going to be probably the final day or the climax of this propaganda event. He'll, he'll, you know, he'll plead, he'll do something. So you can kind of predict that. Today is the 11th, so 4-12-2018. You know, nothing there. Just kind of go forward. You can do it on GameTrainer.com, probably quicker anyway. 
Israel 28, 64, the reflection of 46. So on Friday, ends of Friday, I'd like to conclude, they like to have a lot of things on Friday. Sacrifice 55. Mark Zuckerberg very well could do some propaganda events, could have some big climax on this on the Friday. Because Israel equals 28 in the full reduction. So, and, and that's the thing, Israel equals 28. They're going to pair this full reduction then, sync it up with the life lesson number. Zion 17, they were 17 numerology. Mark Zuckerberg is a Zionist Jew, obviously. 13 is a lucky number in Judaism. It's also the 27th prime, ritual 27, sun 27. So that's what I'm thinking. It's not there, just, there's going to be more. You can do, you know, until one of these hits 64. You know, it could easily be on the 22nd. So those are the two dates I'm going to have in mind. The 13th and the 22nd might be another one. Israel 37. Because remember, S is 19 letters, you reduce once. So you add 9 to that, you get 37. 64, Israel 64, 37, 44. See, this is even stronger because you get the three numbers for Israel. 37, 64, and its reflection in 44. And you still get the 1980 morality. And don't be surprised if Mark and Zionist 112. Mark Zuckerberg's going to have a huge, either him or his, this day can be huge for the Zionist Jews. I'm telling you right now. Circle 112, Zionist. So it's the 112th day of the year. With the Zionist Jew and his propaganda. And Israel propaganda. Israel 28, 64 reflection, D44. See? This is how you do it. See, I'm looking ahead. I'm just matching these words with the date numerology because that is exactly what the federal government does on a daily basis. That is what the state of Ohio does. That is what Japan does. That is what Germany does. It doesn't matter. So that's actually really nice to end on. Definitely not going to go any further than that. But if you want to, you can do Mark Zuckerberg's birthday and then just see like from his birthday to those days to help you get more confirmation. It's just like trading or any other form of analysis. You don't want to rely on or you don't need to rely on one indicator. Date numerology, although it's very powerful, it's still one indicator. It's one form of analysis. Gematria is very powerful. And yes, you can just use this alone. You can use this alone a lot. But at the end of the day, there's still one form of analysis, one indicator. It's all about using multiple indicators to decode the federal government. And the three main ones I like is the date numerology, the gematria, and then the span days from the birthday. And then, of course, reading the propaganda and seeing out those same numbers. So it's active board May 14th. It'll be from his upcoming birthday. You can just do that since it's so close. And then you can do, what, what dates do we have? The 13th and the 22nd. So the 13th is four weeks, three days from his birthday, murder 43. It's also, a, it's also a span of four weeks, four days from his birthday. Israel 44 on that, on a date with lifeless number 37. <laughs> Jerusalem 32. America 32. Agenda 32. It's an attractive date. And again, I wouldn't be surprised if he's in two really significant pieces of propaganda both these days. You'll get the 32 again, 31. It's kind of the same numbers, 31, 32. Hmm. I really think he's probably going to be doing stuff in both those days, but, you know, we'll see. And when those days come, I'll just show you. This is how it works all the time. So I hope you enjoyed this video. It's it's always, you know, it's always the length of a Netflix episode. That's, I mean, look at this fear porn. Does talcum powder cause cancer? I mean, yes. Johnson... <laughs> I mean, if it's from Johnson & Johnson, it's from the Zionist Jews, it's from the FDA. I mean, okay, is this news? At 2.44. At 2.44, they're up in this piece of propaganda. On a date with 44 numerology. Oh, today, a date with 44 numerology. And what have I been teaching all video? Because I And why, why do I teach the same thing? Because they do it all They do it all the time. They do it all the time. Not, not anyone near. Now you know. I'm not being annoying. I'm not trying to teach you the 44 pattern again and again. I just have to because the Zionist Jews are doing it again and again. Oh, the number one. No, no, no. Yeah, kill 44, but guess what else sums you 44? <laughs> Cancer sums you 44 and 26. Cancer 44, 26. And then this piece of propaganda 
updated at 2.44 with a 3 minute, 26 second video. Again, Gematrial pairing in the time and the video. See? I break this down so well because they do the same exact pattern every time. Like, I have to give the Zionist Jews, the Freemasons, the Catholic Church credit. Sacrifice 62. She got it when she was 62 years old. See? Kill sacrifice number. 62 to reflection of 26. See? Got it at 62 to reflection of this number. There's sacrifice numbers as well. And then why are they using ovarian cancer? Ovarian 35, 46, 46 for reflection, sacrifice 46. Philema 35, 64. Another, another 1, 2, 4, 61. See, today has been a 1, 2, 4, 61 day. That's all I can say. So much propaganda we've decoded with the 1, 2, 4, 61 today. That's what I'm saying. That's how easy it is. You don't have to know what that means. They're doing it again. It's like the fourth time we've seen it today. And this video hasn't been an hour long. Some 4,800 women. 48. 1, 2, 4 to the sum of 48 divisors. Hoax 48, Propaganda 48, Freemason 48, Illuminati 48, the same numbers all, all day long. Johnson and Johnson, that's 1, 101, 10, 10, Revelation 10, 10, trace the 10th letter in the Jewish cipher, Revelation something 10, 10. Johnson and Johnson, some 64, 62, the 62 year old woman, you see this? 62 year old woman, Bavarian, Bavarian Illuminati 188, sitting like a Satan 190, 64. We're just talking about these assholes. I gotta say in 19064. You know, this propaganda is just too much. It really is. It really is. But this has been chock full of nothing but examples. Like after this video, you can't be like, oh, I don't get this. Yeah, I know I go too fast. I try not to. <laughs> but I can't really go any slower. I mean, oh, I can, but these videos will then be like two hours long. Jesuit Order 72, Sun 72. This is an actor, Deborah Giannacchini. You know, this is coded name. Oops, I didn't copy that. But don't you see how easy this propaganda is to, to code? 103 to 27 prime, Revelation 149, the 35th prime. We have the 3564. Freemason 96, Saturn 69, Revelation the 66th book of the Bible, Death 228. Her initials are fourth letter, seventh letter, 47. I mean, that's what I'm saying. So it's actor with the 47 initials. You know, this is fake propaganda. Her name, some 35 as well. Israel 35. No, Israel 37, Philemon 35. This is that whole trope. Israel, Philemon, Zion. I mean, what's I'm saying I got Satan? What else do you want to see? 47 initials. I mean, clearly an actor. I mean, it's clearly look, look, look at she's looking. It's an actor. I can't explain it anymore. Emeris Talc America. She sued these two Freemasonic corporations. Blood Sacrifice 76. 113, number for dis mainstream dishonesty. A cosmetic love. All these little headlines here are all coded. All of them. Every time. See? 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 See this art? Unbelievable. Ovarian cancer, 61. Well, you don't need a single reduction because there's no S in ovarian cancer. A cosmetic love, but you need this, you need the S exception for that because there's an S. Do you see? But you see what I'm saying? What I'm doing? And then they flip around the 142, 124 reshuffling. This is clear evidence. This is coded propaganda. For 42 to 142. Gematria 142, Masonic. And this is one thing I just don't know. It's just to me, it's one of those ones I just like a lot. Masonic slogan 142, because that is their slogan 142. But it's a special number to Freemasons. Just keep that in mind, because it relates to 42, Freemason 42, Zionism 42. Right here, that Novarian Cancer had a little Gematrial game. And just the same things. These are low-hanging fruits that you should have missed. Like, I mean, it's about talcum powders. Just do talcum powder, talcum and powder, you see. And I always just like to copy and paste. Even if you know how to spell the words, like, you're not going to make any mistakes that way. 52. 
52, 52 just like that one slow the one thing we just had the 142 52 61 like talcum powder death killing murder 38 I mean, this is fake propaganda that's what i'm trying to talk, show you talcum powder you know if it causes cancer or whatever it's this is not news it's not new thing it's i mean you know if it's from johnson and johnson i don't know how they formulate their shit so you know i wouldn't doubt it but I'm not gonna. But even then, I'm not gonna be like, "Oh, it's from Johnson and Johnson." Yes, it causes cancer. I can't just say that. But I mean, I trust things. Look, and every day for ten months, for ten hours a day, you're talking about Johnson and Johnson, Revelation ten ten. They have ten ten right here. You see this, Johnson and Johnson, ten months and ten hours. I mean, this is how clear. Yeah, you're probably like, "Wow, like how is that?" So it, yes, this is federal government propaganda. Of course, they are going to do this. Illegal whirlwind. A Zionist Jew Masonic whirlwind. Freemasonry, 158. 58, Reflection, Judaism, 77, and the 77th Meridian. Rosicrucian, 77, 58, Reflection. This is the whole thing. Remember for Freemasonry right here. Smith, 33. You know, clearly, I mean, look at this. This kid knows that they're fucking around. You know, I like him. Their family at Easter. And, you know, just why an Easter photo? You know, go back and see these. And over, you'll see the overlap. This is a long-ass article. But they're, they're selling cancer. Guys, cancer is a fear-run business. They need propaganda to sell fear, to make people go to the doctors. Oh, I've been, you know, I've been using Johnson & Johnson talcum powder for, you know, 10, 20 years now. Let me go spend money at the doctor and get, like, you know, a cancer checkup or something like that. Irresponsible. They put this in quotes. It's coded propaganda. Sing out Satan 190. Reflection of 17, also the 20th prime, death 20. We're ending this video right now. I never seriously are. But we gotta do the propaganda refresh. We gotta do the propaganda refresh. It's probably the same shit. What the FBI was like, oh yeah, they raided, yeah, so you probably all know the FBI raided Donald Trump's, or the, raided his, the White House or something, I don't know. Obviously, obviously they didn't. Obviously they are actors. As I show all the time, the FBI is nothing else than a theater production company. It's all they are. Donald Trump is just one of their actors. And they're participating in a theater play. Look, oh, this is still updated at... I'm just going to be cool and say it's the same piece of propaganda that was updated 601 earlier. But I don't think it is. But I think it could be. But look. Updated at 139. Freemasonry, or this video at length, 139. Freemasonry, 139. Right there. I'm just for Freemasonry again inside this video length. See? Also 99 seconds. About 13 and 99. Connection access Hollywood. I mean, you know, you hope you know they're mocking with this propaganda. I, why do you think I'm trying my best to show you how he's an actor? I don't like it when you're mocked. So I'm trying to show you how he's a Saturnian actor. Look at this shit. Saturn 21, this 17th to 21st Prime. Saturn 73 to ALW. If you're at 2026, you get 93. See, 93. Number for Saturn. Remember, Karen McDougal. That's what I'm saying. Karen McDougal, 22673. Donald Trump had a little thing with that, and now he's saying he's involved with Access Hollywood. See? Yes. He is an actor. I cannot emphasize enough. It's just this alone. It's how he knows a freaking actor participating in propaganda. You know, Mason 62, Tragedy 80, Sacrifice 62, Time, 8, Connected to Time, 171, or 179, the 41st Prime, USA 41, 41, the 13th Prime. But look at these Saturnian numbers right here. That's what I'm saying. Like, I just don't get how someone will not get this. 
I can't show you the Karen McDougal example and then show you this and you say you don't get it. Like, I, I, there's something wrong. I'm not asking you to remember the Karen McDougal example, but if you saw I showed it to you before and I showed it to you now, and you see how access Hollywood, I mean, use your logic. Why? And again, they put it in the quotes. Make sure you know it's part of the, the program. So that's what I'm saying. The FBI, oh, the Post published the video on October 7th. I was looking for 17. I was about to say FBI equals 17. On 107, this is 17. And I want to see the day they raided the home. Maybe that's just for another video because I want to see what date that was on. Because I, you know, I've been, I wasn't making videos then. But you know, this video is already oversaturated with information. I hope you enjoy it all. You know, an hour if nothing else than exposing this actor. So again, if you're new here, because every, every time I call Donald Trump an actor, it sounds like you're a conspiracy theorist, blah, blah, blah. I mean, stop embarrassing yourself. He's clearly nothing else than a theatrical stage performer participating in Masonic, occult, Saturnian propaganda. That is all he does. That's all he is. He is nothing else. He's not a president. He's not some racist man, you know, trying to rile up people. He's not the leader of the free world. He's none of those. He is an actor. He is a theatrical performer, and all he does is participate in federal government, Zionist Jew propaganda. I'll say it one more time. He is an actor participating in Zionist Jew, federal government, Catholic Church, comedy. That's literally all it is. Just like how they give you CC, the Catholic Church, 3-3. Giving you Comedy Central, CC33. Then they give you this actor. This is other, this is Comedy Central Plus. That's literally all it is. It's another form of Comedy Central from the same exact creators. But instead of putting on, always on Comedy Central, they have it on CNN, they have it on Fox News. They have it in your life, make you think it's real. All actors, all stooges. And that's why I can say I feel comfortable telling you this all the time because I can't, I mean, what else am I going to say? Look at their faces. Look at how they do it all by the numbers, doing it all from their birthdays. Just think about everything you saw in this video, right? So now can you walk away knowing that Donald Trump is nothing else than a piece of shit, Zionist Jew actor, a Saturnian actor participating in Thelemic Saturnian propaganda. He is nothing else. Can you repeat, repeat that for me? He is nothing else than an actor. I cannot emphasize enough because I just cannot take it anymore. People think, oh, you're an apprentice actor. I get it. No, no, no. He is a born to be fake news actor. And it's not because I'm against Trump. Who else is the same exact thing? This bitch ass right here. This is an actor, a fake news propagandist. Selling you out all day long by the numbers. He does not like you. He hates you. He does what his Zionist Jew employers tell him to do. See? He does what his Zionist Jew employers tell him what to do. Another actor. He does what the Zionist Jews tell him what to do. He does what the Jesuit order tells him what to do. Another theatrical stage performer. He did what the Zionist Jews told him what to do. He did what the Jesuit order, he did what the Catholic Church instructed him to do. He died at 67, Freemasonry 67, put into power at 57, Scottish Rite 57. He's a Scottish Rite Freemason and an actor participating in Zionist Jew federal government propaganda. That is all he is, that's all he did. Another actor for the federal government, MLK, participating in Zionist Jew fake news propaganda. I can go all day. I can literally go all day long. Another actor participating in Zionist Jew fake news propaganda, Justin Bieber. And you can name them all. Matt Damon, name them all. Actors. Like, I hope you get it now. Like, I, I'm not kidding when I call these people out. I'm not kidding when I decode them. And all these people I show you, you can do what I applied today, you can apply in all their lives. 
everything they participate in, you see it's all by the numbers. I mean, I have no problem showing these people. If you think none of these people are actors, here's a, I'll give you $10,000. Or to make it even more believable, I'll give you $1,000 if you can show me how these people I named are not coded, they're not synced up by designers, Jews, or any of that. Fine, we'll leave off this actor. This is an actor, Pope Francis, a theatrical stage performer, a deceiver, participating in Jesuit order propaganda. I mean, look, how is he not an actor? Look what he's doing. Man's clearly an actor, just deceiving you. A piece of shit. You know, mocking God on a daily basis. Him, Donald Trump, are best Jesuit buddies. This is a Saturnian actor, a Thelemic buffoon, participating in Zionist Jew, Jesuit Order, Scottish Rite, Freemasonic propaganda. Everything I've seen in the com is nothing else than a bunch of Zionist Jew propaganda. I'll buy the numbers. You see. One for all 33, got 141. But yep. Oh wow, look at this. By by <laughs> by, <laughs> by the numbers. They're they're literally telling you that this propaganda is by the numbers. You know they're 41, but you know, Route 33 got 141 is like like I just said, Prophecy 110, Masonic 115, Killing 115. Oh my goodness. Just unbelievable. <laughs> the little 3.14 they got right here. Oh, God. Stuff is just disgusting. All right. I'm, see, I, I'm just so addicted to decoding. It's, it's, it's pretty obvious at this point. Which I'm pretty sure you guys will like that. Oh, yeah, more content. Yeah, I mean, I'll never stop making these videos. But I hope you understand. I, like, anyone, this is all for the new people. Like we can have a di let's have a dialogue, not an argument. Let's have a dialogue, and again, if you if you can prove to me how Donald Trump is not as is, is real, born to, is not born to be, how he was just some rich man with a rich dad, and because his money and connections was able to become president, if you can prove that to me, I will give you as much money as you want. And if you lose, you don't have to give me anything. I mean, there's no, there's, you have nothing to lose. Show me how this is not a Thelemic, a Thelemic attorney act. And uh, you won't be able to because he is. He's 100% a Thelemic attorney actor from the federal government. So if you want to save time, just don't even. Peace out.